Hi, Jimmy. Hey, Biggie. You ready to play some checkers? Uh, no. I don't feel like playing checkers today, Biggie. You don't feel like playing checkers? That doesn't sound no. like you. Well, it's me. What, today. What's going on? Ah. It's my mom and dad, Biggie. They're always telling me what to do. Jimmy, clean your room. Ah. Jimmy, snuggle, snuggle the show. Snuggle the show? Uh, shovel the snow. Okay. Uh, clean your room. Do the laundry. Take out the wait, dog. Wait, wait. So you're, you're complaining about your parents because they're asking you to be part of the family and do some chores? Uh, well, yeah. But it seems like I do all the work, Biggie. You do all the work. So you do all the shopping. You earn the money for the house. And, uh, and you do all the cooking and... And all the all the cleaning of of the whole house, and well, and you biggie. do all your laundry, and and um, you make uh, your own bed every day. I'm sure because that's yeah. I've seen how energetic you are. Yeah, I know. When you say it like that, I feel like a lousy. Well, well, I'm kid. not trying to make you feel lousy, Jimmy, but. You know, it's important that we recognize that parent. it's not easy being a parent. Parents have a hard responsibility of trying to raise a child. Oh, well, yeah, but it's hard to be a kid. It is hard much. to be a kid. And but, I'm learning. Well, yes, you are, but you're, they're trying to teach you certain things so that for the rest of your life, you'll have certain habits and certain behaviors that are good. But here's an important thing. Yeah, Your baby. parents already know some of the things you, you don't even know yet and that you're going to have to face. Yeah, I know. And, and making sure that you do it right now will help you later on when it's time when you grow up. To. Oh, well, yeah, I guess. Well, he, here's an example. You know, okay. it's, it's easy to complain about our parents because they want us to do something, but we don't realize that we're helping them by doing it. Yeah. They're already working hard. Your both your parents work every day. I know that because I've talked to them. Both yeah. of them have, have worked hard to make sure that you've got food to eat and that everything yeah. is good. And the fact oh. that they ask you to help, well, that's just being part of a family. Yeah. It says in the Bible, one of the commandments, Jimmy, is honor your father and mother. And, oh. and God wants us to honor them because... He understands that as children, we have to respect their wisdom. We have to respect their thoughts. That's if they're, they're, they're being good and honest and, 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 and forthright. Because yeah. some parents are not necessarily good. But I know your parents are good. So well, I know that they're not... My parents are awesome, really. Yeah, they are. But man, I, I feel like I'm doing all the work sometimes. But now that you say all that... I guess I don't, huh? Well, and I've also noticed that sometimes when I was a young boy like yourself, I was just more interested in doing other things than shoveling snow or... Wow, oh, shoveling snow is horrible. Or cleaning my room. You know, I, so it was partially I was a little bit lazy and I'd rather do something else. Oh. But uh, I, that kind of sounds like me, Biggie. Yeah. Yeah. But I think what your parents are trying to show you is that we have to be responsible, not just for ourselves, but our environment <sighs> and for one another. Yeah. When I you know. shovel the snow, right. doesn't that help your parents? Yeah. Okay. When, when, you, when you clean your room, does that maybe take one less burden off your parents' minds? Yeah, especially my mom. And when you pick up your dirty laundry, doesn't that save her the steps of picking up your dirty laundry? Yeah, she hates it too. Well, that's because she's trying, she's got a lot of other things to think of. Well, I always thought because it's too, they're too dirty. Well, no, she, <laughs> she's, she's taking care of you since you were very small. Yep. And she's going to be responsible for you for her whole life. Wow. She's going to be looking after you, making sure you're okay. You mean she's going to make sure I always pick up my underwear, even when I'm not <laughs> at home? Probably not. But she, hopefully she's teaching you now. So that when you're not at home and you're out in, on your own, that you'll be responsible for yourself. She's teaching you oh. some good habits. Yeah, I, I kind of like that, Biggie. But I hate shoveling snow, Biggie. 
It's well, the bane of my existence. <laughs> I can believe that. None of, many of us don't uh, like shoveling snow, but it's part of the price of living here. Yeah, I and, know. And, and, I and know it helps, I know. And, and you, I know that you're frustrated, and I can appreciate being frustrated, but I also know that when, you're, when you think about it, you're going to be very happy that the fact that you've got a nice home, that you're able to shovel snow to help your parents, and that life is pretty good for you. Yeah. They did get me a new skateboard. Yeah, and they love you very much. Yeah, I know. So let's, uh, let's just recognize that you, you're, you're a pretty fortunate young man. I am. And uh, that your parents love you. And if you honor your, pa your parents and you show them that you're, you're caring and you're, you're conscientious, yeah. they might not complain as much or ask you to do as much. Oh, yeah. Maybe I'll get a bigger allowance. Maybe. But maybe just do it for the reward of knowing that if the sidewalk is shoveled, your mom or dad may not fall or a neighbor may not fall. Oh, yeah. Again, it's being thoughtful of your environment. Okay. You know, all we're, right, all, we're all part of it. Yeah. Thanks, Biggie. Yeah, you're welcome. Just remember, honor your mother and father and love okay. them. Okay. Because they love you. Yeah, I know. I love them, too. I know you do. And that can be frustrating sometimes. Yeah. It's hard to live with people. Yep. That's why God asks us to be patient and kind. Oh. Do you think you can That's be patient true. and kind with your mom and dad? I'm trying, Biggie. Okay. Well, you want, ready to play some checkers? Yeah, okay. Okay. Let's 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 play. Okay.